Welcome back. India successfully test fired its indigenously developed surface to air Akash missile of Air Force version from the integrated test range at Chandipur, the fifth trial of the anti aircraft system in a fortnight. The missile with a strike range of 25 kilometers and capable of carrying a warhead of 60 kgs was test fired from mobile launcher at launch complex 3 of the ITR. On to sports now, Sanya Mirza and Mahesh Bhuputi have reached the finals of the French Open 2012. They defeated Daniel Brasieli and Galina Wozbokova 6-4, 6-2 in a straight sets. Bhuputi Mirza might meet Pace Vesnina in the finals. Moving on, the transit of Venus, a rare celestial spectacle and the last one for this century, unfolded in the morning sky all across the country, enthralling astro enthusiasts. Scientists and amateur astronomers alike celebrated the arrival of Venus, peering up to the skies to watch a dark black spot slide over the sun's surface. The next Venus transit is expected to happen after 117 years. It's a pleasure to watch the transit of Venus with the solar filter and that too free of cost. The Science and Technology Center in Chennai has made suitable arrangements for the public to gaze at the sky. You can clearly uh, see public watching the transit of Venus. What you see is a filter, it's a solar filter. It's called, uh, in fact, a welding filter, shed 14. And uh, what you see at present is a sophisticated solar filter. People say it cost around 3 lakh rupees. And the Science and Technology Center have made all the necessary arrangements for students, for school students, college students, and uh, uh, in, in fact, kindergarten skills. And uh, in fact, people in the 70s have uh, shown interest to come all the way to the Science and Technology Center here in Kotruburam to watch uh, the transit of Venus. Our crime correspondent Salim also caught up with the Joint Commissioner of East Chennai who was also one among the stargazers. I'm at the Science and Technology Centre here in Kotrupuram and I'm now joined by Mr. Sesha Sai, Joint Commissioner of Police East Chennai. Uh, sir, it's a pleasure seeing you here. In fact, uh, in, the, in the morning I was unable to identify you. You were in your sports sphere. So, please tell us about what did you observe uh, in the solar filter? Uh, it's a grand uh, day for the you know, science lovers actually. And uh, after 2004, I, I came here in 2004 also. 2012, I, once again it is happening. Again, uh, afterwards, no, it will take another 112 years uh, to see this. We will not be here. But it's a grand event. The Birla Planetarium people have organized it in a grand manner. And uh, people are really enjoying. Since it is uh, spread over uh, more than four or five hours, uh, there is no hurry for anybody. And all of them have been given the chance to have a look at the telescope. And they have made a beautiful arrangement in this uh, area. And uh, beautifully explained also. And uh, the material that they gave us, it is worth worth reading actually. Many details are given in this material. And thanks to Birla Planetarium people. And that's a wrap on headlines now. Stay tuned to NDTV Hindu for more news and updates. Coming up is News in Tamil.